Yo, 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 what's cracking, YouTube? It's me, your host, Tune, aka your favorite YouTube content creator. Back at you again with another episode, uh, another video. The Walking Dead Defender Series, um, episode 10. Um, let's get straight into it. Before we get started, really, uh, I need you to do me a favor like, subscribe, share. Follow my Twitter, my Instagram, it's in the description below. Click the notification bell so every time I post new content, you will be notified. And, um, yeah, man, without further ado, let's get into it. Should pick off exactly where um episode nine left off at. And my cat is right. Here. My cat is right next to me. Y'all can hear. Where was I? At? Oh yeah, We're right in here. Business. Antibiotics, morphine. We take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. All right, let's watch this third tape. Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Oh, man. That's why she wanted to kill that zombie him so much. Well, shit. Wait, can I go back? I thought I saw something. Not working. Oh, <laughs> that wasn't nothing. This is day eighty-two since the outbreak. Fifteen forty-seven. Doctor Logan and consultation. Oh man, I did not mean to do this. Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oh, Person crap. I can't skip it or nothing. Examinations and consultations. That's stupid. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I could see old evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this, but I need you to come back no later than tomorrow, or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. I can't believe I watched that all over again. Let's get out of here before I do something else that I don't mean to do. Surprise them zombies ain't break in yet. I hate this camera angle. Jesus Christ! Whoa! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. 
I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah, uh, about that. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Here you go. What's that? Nothing. You can quit with the Ag Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place, earn their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. Damn. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. Mm. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Did you leave Clementine alone? No, Kenny's with her. We still can't open that armory door. You sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Ben? Where did you get that? Oh, just found God. it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. This guy's an idiot. Oh, shit! This guy's an idiot. That was me. Yeah, that was Nice shot. Thanks. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! This is my fault, all my fault. The hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean, this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Ben, shut the fuck up. Fuck you. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Doug, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Focus on getting out of here! You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip a skinny little ass later. <laughs> right now, we gotta go! Nice group you got here. 
Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omid, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On oh, second crap. thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? I'm sorry, Ben. I've got to do what's best for the group. And that means cutting you loose. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. She is getting now killed. Can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on. <laughs> So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's gotta be a way out down here. Upstairs. Lee, look. Oh, crap. Crap! Jesus! Out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go! Go! Oh, 
Come on, let's go! I just saved him so I can kill him later. <laughs> Krista, everything okay? Oh, me! Clem, stay back. Don't get any closer. I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Already? We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind, but we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Listen, man, about what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. There was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me, to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me.
Oh, man, I better not be thinking about leaving her. Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. I thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me? Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Ben's a good kid. I think he's just feeling guilty about some of the decisions he's made. He's gotten a feeling like he's a burden on the rest of us. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. Oh. I never found out who was on the walkie talkie. <sighs> Clementine? 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 Clementine! I don't trust that. I know it. Oh, did I get bit?
Did I get bit? Yep. Lee? Lee? You out here? Lee! Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. No way. No, no fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. And who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Clementine's my responsibility. I can't ask any of you to risk your lives over this. This is something I have to do alone. We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. Damn, I got bit. Lee, man, you know I care about Clementine. And I am a Christian man. But I keep asking myself, if this was me asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been. Whoa. And family's all that matters. And you were there for Kotch and Duck when it mattered most, I guess. All right, I'm in. What about you, Ben? Now hold on a damn minute. I'm not going if this little shitbird is, too. Lee, you want to bring Clementine back alive, you'll leave him behind. He fucks up everything he touches. Ben, I'm sorry, but I need Kenny on this. Maybe you should stay with the boat. Okay, sure. Just don't fucking lay a finger on it, you hear? Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon. See if he's longer. Let's head I on. actually meant to bring him with me. I Are didn't okay mean... okay just leaving the boat like this? With only Ben to look after it? What choice do we have? If anything has happened to that boat when I get back, I will fucking bury you in that backyard. Jesus. Watch they all gonna be gone. Told you. Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Earn it! Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt.
Are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Holy... Where have you taken her? This is Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Oh man, okay, I'm back. <laughs> my controller had died. I hope you can hear me. My control. Who came with you? 13%. 10%. Okay, 16% of people bought everybody. All right, well, I hope y'all can hear. I hope y'all heard me, like, cause like that the last couple seconds, my my controller completely died. So, oh man, that was that was crazy. But yeah, man, that's the end of um, I think episode five or something like that. Of what it was like, got one more episode, and um, this video is gonna be kind of short. It's only 13 minutes in, but um, I don't want to start another episode and then like I can't load it and stuff like that. You feel me? I mean, I can't save it in a certain spot, so we're just gonna end it right here. Um, I'm gonna let this run off a little bit and then it's gonna show me like Should show like a like a coming soon or whatever like a preview of the next trailer. I mean the next episode so um, I actually just made a mess looking for my cord so so I can charge up my my ex my controller so um, Let me do this. I'll let this run off and um, I'll be back Okay, I'm back. Oh, well, it didn't show. It, it didn't show like a preview for next. So let's just see where we at with it. So I'll continue. Oh yeah, here we go. All right, no time left. All right, so we're in the last episode of season one. So um, yeah, we're not gonna do it. Like I said, we're not gonna do it this episode. It's gonna be this is a short one. So episode ten will be short. So um. Um, stay tuned for next episode, man. Y'all know what to do, man. Like, subscribe, share. Follow my Twitter and my Instagram. What's in the description below. Click the notification bell so every time I post new content, you will be notified. And as always, from me, your host, Tune, a.k.a. your favorite YouTube content creator, you know what to do. Have a nice day.